Beijing, Chinese telecommunications and smartphone giant Huawei is doubling down on selling its tech in the competitive electric car market. The company has emphasized it doesn't manufacture cars. Instead, it sells tech components such as its Harmony OS operating system and driver assist product, or works with automakers to create new EV brands. Huawei on Tuesday confirmed it is working with at least four traditional automakers in China on new car brands, after news over the weekend of a joint venture with Chang'an Automobile for car technology. Chang'an and Huawei are already partners for the Avatar electric car brand, created in 2018 with electric car battery giant contemporary Amperex technology. Avatar's SUV and sedan each sell for slightly more than the equivalent of $42,000. Huawei is also working with Cherry on the Luxeed electric car brand, which revealed details for its S7 sedan on Tuesday. Similar partnerships with BAIC Motor and Jack Motor are in the works, Richard Yu, head of Huawei's car-related and consumer business, said at a Luxeed launch event Tuesday. Bayek, whose ArcFox electric brand already uses Huawei tech, and Jack did not immediately respond to a request for comment. Chinese automakers with products lacking in the tech necessary to compete seem more than happy to use Huawei's tech to fill the voids, said Tula, founder of Beijing-based advisory firm Sino Auto Insights. It's still too early to know how Huawei's solution measures up to its competitors but they like many other tech companies, see the opportunity and are going all in on it, he said. Tencent, which operates China's social media app WeChat, has claimed it supplies BMW and some other automakers with car tech. Chinese smartphone and home appliance company Xiaomi plans to release a car in the first half of next year. The company announced in late October a new operating system called Hyper OS. Huawei's revenue from its consumer business has halved since the U.S. put the company on a blacklist that restricts it from buying from U.S. suppliers. That includes licensed access to the latest versions of Google's Android operating system. Huawei has instead released its own system, called Harmony OS. In the first half of the year, Huawei's consumer revenue was 103.5 billion yuan, $14.27 billion, while the company's intelligent automotive solutions, whose products include tech for new energy vehicles, saw revenue of 1 billion yuan. Other car-related revenue are also included in other parts of the business. Huawei's Yu said Tuesday the company works with automakers in three ways. Time to invest in China? The pros weigh in and name sectors, and stocks to play right now Huawei is giving Apple stiff competition in China.